So, today for you all, I'm going to be filming a little haul video of a few things I picked up recently at Ulta. So this is just a tiny haul. I only have about six items in it, but all the things I picked up are things I've really been interested in trying, and there is one essential mixed in there. But most of the things I picked up are just things that I've really been interested in trying. So I love haul videos, and I'm sure most of you love haul videos as well. So if you guys are interested in seeing everything I picked up in my most recent Ulta haul, then you can go ahead and stay tuned. So the first thing I picked up was just an essential item for me, and that is my L'Oreal Magic Skin Beauty Beautifier BB Cream in the color light. So I still really love this BB Cream and I was running out of my other one so I decided to pick it up just because I really like this BB Cream. I really like this one and the Olay BB Cream as well. It's kind of a tie between those as which one is my favorite. I wear this one when I want a little more coverage, when I just want a little more of a foundation kind of look. So I needed another one of these so I went ahead and picked this the up. The next item that I picked up is a product that arose186 here on YouTube talks about all the time and she did talk about them for a while so I was always interested in trying out these products. And that is a Stila eyeshadow palette, and I picked up the In the Light eyeshadow palette. So I've heard Aeros 186 talk about all of these Stila eyeshadow palettes, so I definitely wanted to give one a try. And the reason I got this palette is because it has the color Kitten in it. So this is what the palette looks like when you open it up. It kind of reminds me of the Naked palette. It just has a lot of really nice neutral colors. It has some matte colors, and it also has some shimmery colors in it. But I picked it up for the reason that it has the color Kitten in it, because that is Stila's signature color, and I really wanted wanted to pick up that eyeshadow anyway and since the single pan of that eyeshadow would have been $18 and this was $39 I thought why not get a ton of more eyeshadows out of it for my dollar. It also comes with a little brown eyeliner which is really nice so I just heard a lot of really great things about this palette. I think it's great for your everyday neutral eye and I pretty much only wear like neutral shades like this on my lids so I really wanted to pick this up and mainly for the reason that it has kitten in it. The next item I picked up is another Stila product and that is the Stila Smudge Pot in the color Kitten. So as you guys can see I was really into the color Kitten because I've heard so many YouTubers ever since I started YouTube rave about the shade Kitten from Estila. I just know it's their number one selling shadow and kind of like what they're known for and just everyone that uses it loves it. So I decided to pick up the Smudge Pot as well because I know Sarah Bell 93 x uses this and she used it in one of her tutorials and it just looked so pretty and looked like a really great base for her eyeshadows. So I went ahead and picked this up because I just wanted every form of Kitten that I could find because I just know it's such a great shadow and I just really wanted to try it the next out. next product I picked up was a nail polish and this is a red carpet LED gel nail polish and this is in the color Parisian chic so again as you guys know I love my mint polishes and this is just kind of another minty polish and the reason I picked it up is because it's a gel polish and as many of you know I have the Sephora by OPI gel shine manicure kit so I wanted to pick up this because then I could have a mint color in gel form the red carpet gel manicure polishes are really good they really last for a really long time they give a lot of shine and I think they work really well with the Sephora kit and they're a lot less expensive than the Sephora polishes. So I really like this color. As you guys know, I love my mints and it was pretty cheap so I decided to go ahead and pick up this Next color. product I picked up is a NYX lip gloss. Now I am obsessed with the NYX lip glosses. I think they're really great. They really last for a really long time and you can't beat the price of them. The lip gloss I picked up was only $6 and I just think their lip glosses are really great. I think NYX is kind of an underrated brand. I don't hear a lot of people talk about it but I think all of their stuff is really great. So I picked up one of their Mega Shine lip glosses and I picked it up in the color beige. Now Miss Glamorazzi here on YouTube raves about this product. She loves the color beige of the NYX lip glosses and I see why she really likes it. So it's just kind of a really basic pink color that's kind of more mauve -y. It's not really beige at all but it's just kind of a really nice mauve -y pink color and I think it looks really pretty on the lips. I've tried it out a few times and I totally love it. On its own it kind of just mimics your natural lip color and kind of just enhances your natural lip color but it also looks good over lip product. I just think it's a really nice gloss that adds a lot of shine and a little bit of color to your lips. So the final thing I picked up in this haul video is a Maybelline lipstick. So I've heard so many things about the Maybelline Vivids line. I know people love it and I've just heard that they're a really fun lipstick line for the spring and summer so I decided to pick up a color from that and I picked up the color Vivid Rose which is so pretty. I see why people love the Maybelline Vivids line because it's a gorgeous line. It has the most brightest fun colored lipstick. So this is the color I picked up and it is in Vivid Rose. So it is just a really shocking pink rosy color. It's really fun, really bright. It's not so much a fuchsia as it is kind of a corally pink, but I think it's really pretty. I've already worn it a few times and I really like it. I just think this is a really fun lipstick for the spring and summertime and I definitely want to pick up more of the Maybelline Vivids lipsticks because I've really been getting into bold lip colors lately. I think they're really fun and I just think they make a shocking statement. So I definitely want to pick up more of these because I'm really loving this one that I picked up. 
Okay guys, so that was everything I picked up in my most recent beauty haul video. And as you guys can see, I didn't pick up a lot and a lot of the stuff I picked up was kind of inspired by other YouTubers and just stuff that they all love. I wanted to give a try because there's got to be a reason they love it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. I definitely want to know what you guys picked up in your most recent haul video. So if you have a video response to this video or let me know in the comments below what you picked up in your most recent haul video. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave any requests you guys have in the comments below and I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Bye guys!